Welcome back. We are back with our advent series with another activity so simple, even a baby can do it. Kind of. No offense to babies. So, all you're gonna need is a piece of paper for each person participating. And that's really all you need. But optionally, if you'd like to get some crayons or markers or colored pencils or something of the sort to decorate your paper, um, feel free to do so. So if you wanna pause the video and grab a piece of paper and maybe a crayon or two, um, we'll get started. So, we, if you wanna lay out your paper flat, and we're, I'm just gonna color a little bit while we talk about our activity, um, but you don't have to color it. Um, here, take a, there you go. Perfect. So, today we are talking about God. Now, I don't know about you, but sometimes it's hard for me um, when I feel like God's not with me or I can't see God, I can't feel God in my life. Um, sometimes I wonder, where is God? Is he with me? Does he hear my prayers? Well, today we're going to do a little activity to help us remember that God is always with us, even if we don't feel like it. And this is something that we can do to encourage our friends and remind them that God's with them always and something we can do again and again to remind ourselves. So I decorated my paper like this. I didn't spend a lot of time on it, but if you wanna take more time to decorate your paper, you can. And then what we're gonna do is we're gonna make a paper fan. Yeah, so the way that we do that is we just fold. So I'm making a fold like this, just a little bit. And then I'm gonna flip it over and make another fold. And then I'm gonna flip it over again and make another fold like this. Let's see, I'll try to do it so you can see it. I'm gonna flip it over and make another fold down. And it's easier if you do it on a flat surface. surface. I'm just holding it up so you can see what I'm doing. But I'm gonna do the rest down here. And if you're having trouble with this, ask a, ask someone for help. I bet your parents or an older sibling can show you how to do it. And so once we fold it all the way to the edge, we're going to hold it by one corner and fluff it out. And then look, we have a fan. And now see, the cool thing about this fan is this fan doesn't really have any power, but when I move it like this, it makes air. And so the cool thing is that even though we can't see air, when we use our fan, we can see that it has an effect, that this air is moving so fast that it moves Elizabeth's hair and my hair. And this can help us remind us of God. See, just like air, God is all around us all the time. We can't see air, but we know air's around us. And it's the same thing with God. We don't always see God. We don't always feel like God is with us, but that doesn't mean he's not with us. He's always with us. And so when we use our fan to blow air, we can remember that sometimes we can't see things, but that doesn't mean that they're not real. And we can still believe and remember that God is with us no matter what. And so if you wanna make your fan with a friend and fan them and say, remember, God is real. Remember, God is real. So yeah, that's today's activity. I hope you get a chance to do it um, and share with someone and remind someone that God is real even when we, when, when we don't feel like it. See you soon.